Okay. Let's turn down the music a tad. Let me launch into the game or into the save. Game is launched. Then we can switch over to the game captcha. Been having a lot of fun with this game recently. And I hit a crossroads in it that I feel like I should stream. So let's see here. Uh, let's turn that off. And we are in the game. I completed a whole bunch of the rover. Um, Yeah, let's head out. So I want to... Um, I think get a little bit more snow first just so that our engines are working as much as they need to um, and in a minute we'll work on actually let's work on this so I'm going to show you the rover if other people come in I'll, I'll just show it again but I've created the uh, crazy rover suspension <clears throat> on each side. Last time we did half of it, I think. Um, though we hadn't um, actually welded it up. I'll stick to this side. It seems a little bit nicer lighting-wise. Although lighting everywhere just kind of feels a little bit cruddy right now. Um, but finished it on each side. The back one's a little bit longer like we had it. <clears throat> Excuse me. I added some solar panels on top. They're more emergency solar panels than anything um but more of just kind of like a constant semi trickle of power if i ever need it or ever run out of uh snow in the back we have added ouch bay doors to get in i was thinking of like enclosing and adding like little doors like i added at the front um but decided to add these bay doors I don't know why. I just thought they were cool. I guess I need to be back here. And then on top of that, you see I have some more bay doors here. These extend out to kind of give me a little bit bigger of a building platform. It's not much. Just a little bit of an extension, but kind of gives me a little bit of a, hey, let's build something here platform. Um, Again, small, but, you know, kind of cool. It brings me back a little bit to a big ship I made a long time ago. Um, they had the idea of having an extendable building platform, though it wasn't made out of bay doors. Um, so you bring those in. I got a control panel on the inside, too, to control it all. Um, inside is still the same. Uh, oh, we have our boosters. I only did f four small ones for now. I was thinking of putting on one of the big ones, but it just seemed way too big. So we're going to hope that that's enough for now. This is all finished and welded up. I can't remember whether we showed it in the welded up state or not. Then we got the doors along the side. I got some exposed areas for weaponry. Uh, once we find some magnesium. I think that's what we need for ammo and stuff. But what I want to do is add a little drag sled that I can extend that's going to kind of come down here and drag along the earth and gather snow for us. In fact, actually, you know what we're going to do? Hold on. We're going to pull up Windows Paint. That's right. We're going to grab Windows Paint. <laughs> okay. Let's throw... Let's turn off the game capture. And turn on... <laughs> okay. Wow, I can barely see my mouse. Can you see that? Okay. So, we got our rover deal with its, you know, crazy um, three-leg suspension. That we've got going on here wheels wow it's been a long time since i've drawn with a mouse oh isn't it beautiful okay and then 
what I want is like you got the snow here. I want a little deal that's going to come off of this and kind of drag a, a miner right here to collect snow. Does that make sense? That's kind of what we're going for. So I'm going to go back to game capture. <clears throat> so it's going to come off of here and kind of, it probably is not going to go back as far as my picture was showing. <clears throat> Man, something's in my throat. Sorry about that. Um, but just so that like as we're driving, we can also be collecting snow. It's kind of the idea I had. Um, and how it's going to work, hopefully you'll kind of see as we get going. Hopefully it'll make sense. So let's, ouch. Um, coming to here, we are going to need a hinge. Um, yeah, just the full hinge. We will need a piston. Oops, piston. And then Uh, we're not going to need that. We're going to need conveyor parts. Which will be that. And then a drill. <clears throat> Hello, drill. Then theoretically, that should be it. My only other concern is if I'm actually going to connect this to the bottom, how is it going to connect into my grid? So I definitely do want it coming down from the center. That's my biggest concern. So I could go around the outside. And then I got this big ugly thing sticking out of the outside. Is this... I wish we could get medical components so I could see what that looked like finished. I don't think there's a, a port in the bottom. <clears throat> and yeah. How would this... I mean, I guess I could, since this is kind of blocking anyways, I could go straight down from here just right into there. So I kind of have to walk around anyways. Well, maybe that's not a bad idea. And have that be where it connects. <clears throat> Man, let me, let me take a drink of water, see if I can get this out of my throat. Maybe, I don't know. Um. Okay, so. Let's get some stuff in our pocket. Actually, before we do that, let's refill our hydrogen. Uh, refill. Okay. Uh, let's take some of that and some of that. I think that's all we'll really need. Okay. So. And let's get rid of this. Oh, geez. Okay, fine, jerk. Okay. <clears throat> okay. So. Do that. Now, if I do that, I can't, like, fall in there, right? Okay. It's just annoyingly open. Let's do a... Let's do one of them. That'll make me feel a little bit better. And then... Question is, I can put a... Hinge there like that, then theoretically, you can then take one of them, and 
Okay, so we need... Hold on, let's... Let's add one of these to the build planner. As well as the piston. And it looks... I know it looks like a dangling pair of balls, but, you know... It has a purpose. Okay, um, let's also get some energy real quick. So we can continue on. We'll watch the sunset. Look at the beautiful sunset. Or sunrise. Maybe it's a sunrise. Well, it's not really setting or rising at the moment. It's just over there. Look at the sun. <laughs> Aren't I great at this? Okay. Um... Yeah, you. Let's get rid of you. Really? That much steel and interior plate is that heavy? Okay, well. Put all those components into uh, production and withdraw. Though I feel like that hasn't been working for me as of late. And let's try to weld this up. Okay, Mr. Hinge, Mr. Piston, yep. we get some more. Hopefully it will actually extract. No, it will not. Uh, we need some of those. We need some of those. I can't remember what else we needed. Okay, that is finished. What did this still need? Not needed anything? Okay. So, let's go up. Ouch! Okay. Um... Where's our new hinge? Actually, you know what? Let's grab a... What is it, just control panel? Never control panel. Let's... Yeah. Let's extract all that stuff. Hopefully it actually did. Then we can kind of, uh, where's a good place to place it so I can kind of watch what it's doing. Place it right there for now. Okay, so, hinge, we want a hinge, you. Okay, so there goes the hinge. Okay, how do we take the, we need to take this back to zero. Um, reset, shit. Oh, geez. Okay. Um. Is there an easy way to reset the velocity? There's got to be. Reverse. Really? Can I just type zero? God damn it. 
Um, its current angle is at 60 degrees. So yeah, we'll just set the limit at like 60 degrees. And live with that for now. <clears throat> okay, so... I want to... Get, I think we're going to do three. Yeah. And then we can do... Three of those suckers. Now question is on the hinge how fast it will stop we want a high braking torque I don't know Our lower limit, we want Hold on, we want let's keep that there. We do okay, that was Man, we almost don't need the piston at all. We'll leave it there just in case. That's like, let's see how close that gets. Okay. So we're gonna say 20 degrees is our lower limit. 21, yeah, we'll leave it at 21. Um. Then obviously our upper is actually higher than that. So we'll go all the way up to our full 90. Uh, let's get into here. Go to number two. We have a hinge somewhere. Where'd that hinge go? Come on, you gotta be somewhere. Hinge. There it is. Okay, so first we want a... Um... Yeah, decrease velocity, increase velocity, and a reset velocity. Okay. And then we want a... I think it's just a tiggle... <laughs> tiggle? Toggle hinge off? Oh, we need the hinge lock. Let's do that. And then we have, I think we just want to toggle the, the block on and off. So that it just drags. Right? Hmm, hold on. Yeah, I think we want the toggle on and off. So let's, let's do number three and reset. Oh, geez. Um, reset the velocity. Okay. Now. And I think that'll actually work just fine. Right? 
Okay, so let's get figure out what this stuff needs. Lots of stuff. So let's do a drill. We need three of those. And we need three of those. We'll do a couple more so we can do the stuff upstairs. Okay. Let's see if we can grab all this. Um, first, we'll put everything away and we'll do that. Hey, can't grab everything, but that starts us off strong, I think. Okay. Drill number one. Okay, not enough computers for that one. Got some stuff for that. Some stuff for that. There's nothing else in our inventory. Go get some more. Go mouse click. And that theoretically should be the rest of it. But who knows. Here we go. Okay. Okay, that is done. Those are all done. Let's... Get those, and hopefully we have enough. Nope, we need stuff. Okay, so... Let's... Just add two of those. Boy, all sorts of turned around. Okay, so let's just go to our captain's chair for now. Okay, so we have, oh boy, all sorts of stuff. Okay, we have a piston somewhere. Let's do piston snow drag is what we'll call these parts oops so you got the piston snow drag we've got actually you know what we're going to put it at the beginning snow drag piston and then we got a hinge which is the snow drag hinge. And then we will have, why are there so many drills? Those aren't mine. Those are off of the miner. These ones are mine. So we will name these appropriately, I think. Yeah. And then we should probably group them. Hey, Jibo, how you doing? Um, let's do snow drag drills. Good. It's good. Save that. We don't need to see those in the terminal. Do we need to see any of the snow drag stuff? Why can't, am I? There it is. Um, yeah, we shouldn't have to see any of these. God damn it. Uh, see any of those in the terminal. But here in our second one, we can on groups, snow drag drills. We want to toggle those on and off. And then I don't think we need to extend the piston. We can add the piston controls 
here anyways. Wherever the piston is. It's definitely somewhere. And it's definitely here on the screen somewhere. There it is. Okay. So we can do a... Uh, the whole decrease in velocity, increase in velocity, all that. Increase velocity, and we will do a reset. Yeah. Okay. So. Yeah. Let's. Let's lock that hinge for now. So it doesn't go anywhere. We'll test that in a minute. Are we... I feel like we're almost, if not at the point, to drop this thing on its wheels. And give that a try. Are we at that point? I feel like we might be at that point. Um... Oh yeah, I'll give you a tour of stuff I've added. So... these are, This is my crazy suspension I'm doing. If you're familiar with the Curiosity Rover, this is the wheel suspension that the Curiosity Rover has, except it just has one of these sections going in the center, uh, mounted in the center. And I'm doing one on the four corners to help with traction when climbing and for any uh, terrain obstacles slash irregular irregularities. I feel like I almost had that word, but didn't quite get there at the end, and I'm not going to try it again. But that's the suspension. We got our boosters. Just in case solar. And then we got our bay door on the back. As well as... Ouch! Our little extension out the back for building on this platform a little bit. Gives us a little bit more room to build. Not much. But, you know, a little bit. We can retract that. Um, and then we have what we just finished is our snow drag. Yes, it kind of looks like I'm just dragging the rover's balls along the snow but what it'll do is this will drop just as we're driving it'll mine the ice as we're going to help fuel this thing a little bit better or at least that's my hope you know you got your classic front our mount up top yeah we got some cool balls on this thing okay i just remembered i gotta take that connector and i gotta dis able um where's the connector this connector i have to make it so that it doesn't do the parking thing use for parking take that off okay because that could be bad i don't know what it would do it probably drop my really cool rover up there because we're going to take this thing with us our um the tactic cup is going to stay here at this base as a just-in-case measure. Um, oh god, nervous. Let's save real quick. Um, I'm nervous to drop this thing on its wheels. Okay, so let's let's turn on the parking brake. Um. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> okay. I, I don't want to talk about it. Can we just pretend that didn't happen? <laughs> shit. Oh, shit. I want, I want the parking brake engaged. <laughs> um, I'm kind of scared to go out there. <laughs> oh, man. Is everything still intact? Okay, we landed on our wheels. Oh boy, I need to raise that height on all the wheels. Okay. Okay. Oh, and I actually probably have to disable all the rotors. Huh. Okay, so we still got some work to do. Hold on. Let's let's go back in here. Come on, I'm an idiot. Good. You weren't watching. Um 
Okay, so let's get just all the wheels. So all these wheels we want. Um, height offset. Height offset from the center. We want this as high as possible. I believe. We need some decent tire friction. Um, let's reduce that speed limit a little bit. Um, okay, and so now two sets of fronts should be fine. But these ones we need... Oh, no, wait, hold on. This is the back. This needs to have inverted steering. And then these back ones need to have inverted steering. Okay. Real quick, let's go see what that's looking like. Uh, the height, height offset work at all? Is it the other direction? Maybe it's the other way. Um, wheels. All of you. Height offset. It's the other way? Go see what it does. This part always kind of confused me, and I'm not sure I ever really figured it out with my other rovers. No, that's wrong. These are wrong. These just might not have enough suspension to hold the weight of this thing. Which is something I was kind of afraid of. Um I might have to do some of this over if this suspension stuff doesn't work anyways, so. Since our last save was before this. Height offset is the other way. Yeah. We need... What is strength referring to? Is this like shock strength? Let's like take it... Let's take it like way up. What's up, old boy? How you doing? Um, let's go see what that did. Hey, that raised it up. Okay. So, theoretically, let's take that just a shy shorter than the 100% on strength. Let's do like 85 Okay, now we can do, we can look at rotors. These, yeah, all of these rotors need, don't care about limit or anything like that. We can turn off rotor lock. And then I think we want to toggle them off. Yeah, they weren't, they were locked. Yeah. But I think I want them unlocked and off. Cause I don't want, I, I want them, I want them to completely rotate freely. No power. Yeah. See, there's a good, some good rotation. Because our, our butt accidentally fell on the ground. Okay. So, theoretically, <laughs> at this point, I could drop it. So, we're going to try that and hope everything doesn't go bad. Okay. Whoa, no! No! 
Save is completely off. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, that was the funniest fucking thing I've ever seen. That thing did a front flip. Why the hell did it do a front flip? <laughs> man, my chest hurts. Hold on. Oh man. Oh man. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Why did it do that? Why did it do that? Look at that suspension holding up good though. The front. <laughs> Why on earth? Oh my god, that was so funny. Oh man. Okay, well. Exit to main menu. Save before quitting. No. Oh God, why did it do that? <laughs> Clip that as a YouTube short. Yeah, no fucking kidding. Oh man, okay. Man, we gotta redo all that technical stuff again. Do you think it's because my shocks were too strong? The strength of the shocks? And so it like came down on the wheels and bounced it up too high? <laughs> yeah, you don't want it now that it's... Let's go. Resave. The problem is, is that... It was the butt that came up, and due to my little mishap earlier by, re by releasing the parking brake, the wheels were already touching the ground. Unless they were all set up and charged up. <gasps> I wonder if that was it. Like, they had hit the ground... Oh, I bet that was. We've like created a little slingshot spring back here. Okay, we're gonna try that again. But before dropping the parking brake, <laughs> let's go through our checklist real quick and set everything up and then save again. Oh fuck, that was funny. Okay, control panel. Did I do the connector before saving? Okay. That's done. Let's do the wheels. Okay, so all the wheels. Are getting a negative height offset as well as we'll do 85% strength oh wow man I hurt everything hurts okay so the back wheels need to be inverted steering on both sides Okay, and then it was all these rotors need to have rotor lock off <clears throat> as well as they're just going to toggle the block off. Okay, man, I need another drink of water. <clears throat> oh, man. Okay. Was there anything else I did? I don't think there was anything else I did. Um, trying to think. I don't think so. Let's save. And so theoretically, Now that this stuff isn't all <clears throat> um, sprung up, I should be able to drop it and it not do that again. But if it does that again, that means 
the strength of the suspension was the problem and I need to reduce that. Right? That's kind of what we're where we're at. I think that's where we're at. <coughs> oh man. Okay, here we go again. Let's uh <laughs> attempt that again. <laughs> here we go. Everyone hold on to your butts. Oh, come on. S calm down. Calm down. No, 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 no. You're not supposed to be rolling. No, come here. Come here. Come here. Parking brake. Unable to park? What do you mean? No, 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 no. What do you mean you're unable to park? Go forward, damn it. Why? <laughs> Why am I unable to park? Park. Oh, man. Are my wheels off? Wait, hold on. What's going on? Can I turn the wheels? Nothing's going to happen. Nothing's happening to the wheels. Nobody, <laughs> nobody panic yet. Nobody, nobody panic yet. We got this. Okay, wheels aren't, wheels aren't, um, wheels. Wheels. Are they all powered on? They're all on. Oh boy, we're going up a hill. Hey, our suspension's working pretty well though. Why is there no power to the wheels? Okay, everything's evening out. We hit a nice stopping hill. Nothing's broken yet. Right? Okay. My guess is the rotors, but the rotors don't need power. Wait, do you think powering off the rotors cut off power to that grid? There's no way, right? That's not a thing. Look, nailed it. <laughs> totally, totally nailed it. This is where I wanted the rover to end up, okay? But if they are off, is the power off to the grid? Yeah, I guess that's the question. Okay, let's, let's try it. I'll turn on all these rotors again. Toggle the block on. Okay. Un unable to park. What on earth? Yeah, hey, stopped perfectly. Wait, hold on. <clears throat> I'm going to Google something real quick. And if this ends up being what I think it is. <clears throat> um, okay. Power should pass through rotors. And it looks like... <coughs> oh, man. Excuse me. Oh, no. Wait a second. Hold on. In 2018, rotors not transferring power. Well, I haven't played Space Engineers in a while, but decided to give it a go. Went to a Kirk Rover build. It's a custom rear suspension. Yep, yeah, with rotors. Rotors do transfer power, etc., but they cannot transfer controls to wheels. What? No. Edit. There should be a link to master grid type control we can use. Ah. Oh. Shit. From what I can tell, rotors still get power to the main body. Just can't control the damn wheels. Roll controls could work. But in order for me to do that, I'd have to have two remote controls 
So two, four, six. I'd have to have eight remote controls running all the same time. Yeah, AI stuff. Oh no! Oh no! No! no. Um. Oh shit! You can set up hotkeys to control the wheels. Power. I could try to tank drive this thing. Oh no. Yeah, force them on and off essentially, but you have to like sit there and control velocity on each group of wheels. Um <laughs> shit. Okay. Let's see here. Before we fully give up on the suspension. Okay, so we got... Uh, yeah, I could do that. We're going to try this first. So we got all the left. Left. Wheels. Um save and then we got all of the right wheels all right wheels okay <clears throat> um let's see here we got groups okay so we got left wheels is okay so we got a what am I looking for? Hold on. What am I looking for? Is power so the power supply to propulsion? That's set. But how do I like? Propulsion override. Oh, <gasps> there is a steer override. Shit. This is going to get complicated with like timing blocks and stuff. But I think it's the propulsion override that I want. Question mark. Left. Okay, so we got. Uh, decreased propulsion. Increase propulsion. Reset propulsion. We're gonna do that with the other one. Decrease propulsion. Increase propulsion. Uh, reset propulsion. Okay, I actually need to create one more group. That is all the wheels. All wheels. Oh man. Okay. I saved that, right? Did I not do that? Oh, here's all wheels. So all of these we want park brake on and off. Okay. So <laughs> Theoretically, <laughs> if I put my fingers here on the keyboard, oh my gosh, we're moving 100% propulsion. We're not moving. Wow. Okay, let's do negative propulsion. Oh, shit. This thing isn't powerful enough to even climb a hill. Oh, man. Everything about this is failing. Go forward. Damn it. 
it. It felt like such a cool idea. No. Forward. You have forward propulsion. What if I give it my help with my boosters? They didn't do anything. Come on. Oh, sure trying. Damn it. Even if I was controlling my wheels, this thing wouldn't have enough. Hold on. If we go to all wheels, let's give ourselves way more friction. 100% friction. Nothing. <coughs> Damn it. I hate everything. I hate everything. Hate it. Yeah, I can't add more boosters. That's supposed to be a rover. And it can't even drive. Look how sad it is. Those are just like stuck and can't move. Oh, let's make sure we have a decent amount of power still in our power banks. Yeah, everything should have plenty of power. Dang it. Dang it. Why is that one still rotating? It hates life. Hmm. Yeah, I can, but they're five by five wheels and they're huge. They're just way, they're just massive wheels. They're like for a, a rover, like three times this big. So they look kind of goofy. But I might have to use them. Oh, man. I was all excited about my suspension idea and everything. And it's just not going to work. Hmm. I mean, I guess it could be, old boy. I don't know. I don't think so. I don't feel like my small rover had, like, necessarily any, like, bad traction. More so than I seem to notice in, like, videos of other people playing. trying to think of what I could do here. Well, either way, I need to <clears throat> exit the main menu without saving. Dang. Okay. So the question is... <clears throat> I'll show you what the bigger wheels look like. Let me grab a piece of steel. And let's see here. Wheel. Here's a five by five left. That's how much bigger the other wheels are. They're huge. Which, I guess now that I'm looking at it again, isn't... I mean, it kind of matches the size of the rover. But I liked the size of these ones. Damn it. Um. Oh, dang it. I saved after that already rotated. Shit. Oh, well. Um... <laughs> yeah, I need to put snow chains on these tires. That's for sure. Um, uh, the problem is, is that this rover is way too close to the ground to attach these wheels to this kind of suspension system anyways. 
So I wonder if I really do just kind of need to suck it up and attach these like a regular rover would and just have wheels along the side. And maybe do these larger ones. Dang it. Oh man, I had all these really cool ideas in my head at how cool this is going to look. It's just not going to happen. Okay. Well... What do you guys think? I guess I add these wheels just along the edge here and do what, like three on each side? Maybe four? Um, I might ruin my snow drag idea a little bit. Mm hmm. I'm trying to think. So I'm at the point where I can't raise this any higher. I've already committed to its height. So. Adding it onto suspension like this is just not going to work. That I can think of. If you made it longer, maybe still do a three tire thing made the whole rover longer and still try to do the suspension this type of suspension is that what you're saying I could but the problem is, is that <clears throat> in order to attach wheels at the points that these ones are at the whole rover needs to sit higher in the air and I, I don't think I can do that Yeah, tires need more room to make it and make it longer. But then I still have the problem of I can't steer the freaking tires. Okay, Mr. Coming up with an idea, Chibo. Yeah, I could do that. I could do some kind of piston with a mag plate. Oh, that's a good point. Problem is, is that... <laughs> that's how you do yours, huh? Yeah, there you go. <clears throat> Excuse me. The problem is, is that the suspension idea doesn't work. I just want it to look like a monster truck. We could just essentially do a monster truck. Oh, damn it. Um. <laughs> problem is, is I don't know if four wheels even with this size is enough to hold the weight of this thing it's pretty damn heavy it might though and it might have enough traction should we just turn this thing into a stupid monster truck oh man I'm so disappointed <laughs> I just want to go hide in a hole I've been I've been so excited for this to be cool and working for so long. Like I've been working at this, working on this at night for like the last week. Ugh. Okay. Yeah, but it doesn't function. So the wheels have power plus boosters. <laughs> what if you only need to power two wheels? What do you mean? I just have two of these big wheels on here. And the rest free spin. Yeah, but with all six going, it wasn't moving this thing up the hill. Yeah, we had we had all 12 <laughs> wheels trying to push us forward and this thing wasn't moving. Yeah. 
Don't change it yet. Give it more boosters and anything else to add power. <laughs> okay. Okay. We'll... We'll... Okay. We're not done yet. We won't give, yeah, we won't give up yet. More power. Okay. Actually, I saw something once. I wonder if it's actually a thing. Uh, three by three wheel. We are going to add one, two, three, four, five, six. We'll do six initially. Uh, let's go get some more stuff. It was more like a sled instead of wheels. Flies off a, and clips and explodes. Flies off a cliff. Oh, jeez. Stop it. I want it to be cool. Okay. Let's see here. I wonder if this will work to add traction. Can I? Ah, dang it. I don't have room to add it on all of them. Can't even add it on that one. Okay. I can't add it on any of these. So that's not going to work. Let's grab that idea. Um, let's. You know what we could do? I wasn't wanting to do this originally, but we could, we could double up all of these wheels. I wonder if that would work. <clears throat> and then what I mean by that is we have a wheel facing that way, but add one on this side facing towards me. <laughs> yeah, true. I could maybe do that. But I'm thinking of adding an extra wheel. Okay, hold on. This is going to take for freaking ever to keep track of everything. Okay, so we need to shift everything back in. So let's get wheels. Okay, so we got a left three by three. And a right three by three. Let's do it on the right hand side first. So let's get rid of these and we'll do three. <clears throat> Take a bunch of components. I don't know if they actually gave me the ones I wanted. We're going to try it. So we said right hand side first. Ooh, except it needs to be reversed. So right hand ones need to go on the left. Okay. So if I go into here like this. Do something like that on each of these. Now the reason I didn't want to do this before is that it limits the amount of rotation this fancy suspension can have. <clears throat> but um it might still work. Okay. Let's. I'm in full lean back mode, trying to be comfy during my my sad times. Okay, that clearly doesn't have enough stuff. Um. Uh, ouch! <laughs> I hate everything. I hate everything. The stream has gone completely. <sighs> hate everything. Hate it all. Why did I stream tonight? I hate everything. <sighs> Hi, dead body. Where's my pack? Yeah, you just slide away. I don't want anything to do with you. Go away. Keep sliding. Yeah, slide down the mountain. I don't like you. Go away, Spectra. 
Oh, okay. Just disappear then. Yeah, you can die if you fly too hard into a surface. You just did. Okay. Okay. Um, need lots more stuff. Wrong side. Um... What was I trying to do? Go to here. Here we go. Wait, hold on. Actually, is it doing for a small grid? No, it's doing it for the big grid. I don't know why it likes to think all components were grabbed successfully for all three of those, but definitely isn't. Nice. Rover recovery. Success. Did it? Yeah, the build planner is just all sorts of messed up. Okay, so what do I need? I need... Uh, <clears throat> I need a bunch of large steel tubes is what I need. Those are freaking heavy. Okay. Let's get some more of those. Um, don't think I need any of those right now. Okay, hold on. I gotta readjust my sitting situation. <clears throat> okay. Uh, I didn't grab construction components. It's fine. Just trying to fill in these large steel tubes. That everything is requiring. <clears throat> did I finish off this wheel? Yeah, I did. Okay, so now I need construction components and steel plate. Uh, just more of that. Yeah, just construction component and steel plate. Let's give some of that. What's the beeping that keeps hearing that keeps going on? I don't know what that is. <clears throat> uh, put that away. Grab some of that. Grab some of that. What is that sound coming from? Is that like from one of the sites I like opened up or something? Stop it. You guys hear that beeping? It's like happening or am I losing it? I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if I'm just like losing it. Okay, I'm apparently losing it. Okay, so three more wheels done. Unfortunately, we now need to go into our ship and make sure we properly name and label them. Okay, so that was the the front left, or yeah, front left, or left front. So we can steal that. Uh. We will do left, front, inner. Left, front, inner. Okay. Oh, shoot. Um, we'll save, because why not? Then we need to...
We'll just try this again because we can. Just add a bunch. <clears throat> Hopefully it grabs enough components for it. Um, unfortunately, I was full on a bunch of other stuff, so we'll see what happens with that. I forgot. Forgot I grabbed a bunch of steel plate components. Okay, so we're still doing the right. So we will do the back side next. Oh, please be room for everything. Oh, thank goodness it allowed me to make the wheel there. Okay, so let's see what I am able to add. The large steel tube for that one. Large steel tube for that one. Same with that. And this. In this. Okay, I just need to get a bunch of large steel tube. Hopefully that's enough. Okay. Did I finish this one off? I did. Oh man, I got a headache from <clears throat> my like choking, laughing, chest dying stuff I did earlier. So that concerns me a little bit that I can only go that high. Just a tad higher than that, but oh well. Oh man, I might have to take some Advil. <laughs> Okay, so let's go. So we had the left back wheel for these three. I'll do inner. I highly suggest naming. If you're ended up in a ship that has a lot of stuff, I highly suggest naming as you add. Just to help keep track so you don't have to guess later. Okay, so now I can, we can do the next ones. I don't think it really matters, but do this. And get a bunch of stuff. And now these ones we need to do left. That. Ouch. And that. Almost all the stuff. Uh, man, I need more construction components and steel plate for all that stuff. This just needs a lot more of everything. Well, let's see what it'll give me when I go. Else we'll click on it again. Let's see, if it'll give me more stuff. Did probably not enough. So I will. Yeah, it's definitely not enough. I think I need at least another 10 of that. Grab 100 of that. Maybe a little bit more of that. Okay. My dangly bits run into tires? I don't think so. No, just barely. Our balls won't get scraped by our wheels. Thankfully. Because that would be painful. Uh, 
need more construction components and steel plate. Ouch. Excuse me. Oh, shoot. I didn't mean to hit that. Okay, let's add a bunch of that. Go back down. Okay, that one did get finished. Okay, so those three are done. Oh shoot, I'm out of height. I hate everything. Why didn't any, you guys had ample time to tell me I was running out of hydrogen. Ample time. Let's hope that this thing will replace it. Come on. Fill it up. That was entirely your fault. I will take no blame for that. Okay, so we need to do the front. Front right now, correct? Yeah. Let's label that up. <clears throat> Uh, right front. Right front, inner. Okay. Okay. Oh, shoot. I added an extra something onto that one. <laughs> Inner F. Okay. Um, let's get out of that. Might as well save. And let's grab... Yeah, let's just go off of the components we have right now. And here we are doing left ones. Some of that. And some of that. Okay, good. Wheel went on that one. So, so far we need more steel plates. Yes, more steel plates. Steel plate in construction. Steel plate construction and tube. Okay, steel plate construction and big steel tubes. So we needed what, like, is that much? Seems like our, I got him out. Let's go with that. This one actually finished? No, it did not. Okay. We're almost there. Okay, back right tires are done. So let's go label those up.
Okay, we got right back, inner. Okay. Okay, everything's properly labeled. Oh man, we got a lot more to do. Okay, let's take... Wait, why is there only one left back inner? Oh shit. These ones will be the left back inner. Right here. Left back inner. Left back inner. Okay. So you got one, two, three. Three. Um, right front inner one, two, three. Right back inner one, two, three. Okay, so these we need to put strength at 85 and height offset maximum and then. The right back inner needs to be inverted. It doesn't matter with the string, but I'm going to do it anyways. Um, then left back inner needs to be inverted. Just in case I decide to try to do steering. Um... And actually, while I'm here, I wanted to go through the rotors because I don't think all of them unlocked. So that one's unlocked. That one's unlocked. That one is unlocked. Well, maybe they did all unlock. Oh, they all unlocked. Okay. Um... I sure didn't feel like it. Breaking torque. Care about any of that? Don't think so. At this point, I probably just want all the rotors off. Uh, hold on. Oh, they all currently are off. Okay. Well, fine then. Okay. Um. I guess there's just not enough weight on these front ones to really force it to rotate just yet. <clears throat> okay. Let's save. So the question is, do we try it with just this and see if with double the amount of wheels, it functions any better? Oh, shoot. I got to change groups. Well, I got to... Ah, shit. I got to do all the grouping stuff again with the wheels. Hold on. Everybody pause. <laughs> yes. Save again. First... We have to, hold on, let's. Hold on. Where are my wheel groups? Oh, I built those after this, okay, yeah. So this is all the right ones. All right, wheels. Um, I 
left wheels and all wheels <laughs> cut it free we will we will we will okay so i need to go into no i do want to be in the first one okay okay let's see here there's all wheels Wait, did I not actually name them? Did I forget to hit save? Damn it, I forgot to hit save. Except for on the all ones. Left wheels save. Right wheels save. Okay. Now I can come into here. Wheels, right wheels, all wheels. Okay, so left. We need a decrease propulsion. Increase propulsion. Reset propulsion. Decrease propulsion. Increase propulsion. Uh, reset propulsion. Then all wheels. You want parking brake on and off. And then at that point, we're now going to save. And then let's let's come into here. Parking brake is apparently on, or whatever that's worth. I'm gonna keep it in escape. There we go. Let's uh, ooh, let's dump everything in my inventory off, and then we will cut this baby loose. Let's see what happens. Why did I hit X? I wanted to hit Alt. There we go. Okay. I have a much higher chance of getting completely run over. We gotta do this from the proper direction, just in case it decides to do another front flip. Okay, here we go. <laughs> this is my favorite part. I don't like it that it's your favorite part. Okay, here we go. Oh, okay. No front flips. Why is this rotor locked and these wheels aren't allowing to be connected to the ground? <sighs> Damn it. Okay. Come on, let me in. Let me in. Let me get to the seat. Okay. Okay, we got we got time. We're doing okay. Let's do these up to 100%. And turn off parking brake. Come on, babies. Catch that grip. Come on. Yeah, see, my front suspension isn't working at all. Oh, it's lurking a little bit. That one's not really wanting to. This right side's not wanting to work. This one's working too well. Grip, baby, grip. Come on. Oh, there's some magnesium right there. I'll have to get that at some point. Oh, and right next to the other silicone. Why are I stopping? Come on. Come on. Please. Come on. We're slowing down. Maybe. Okay. Come on. It really wants to. Get a little boost for my boosters. Come on. There we go. God, this thing's just not powerful enough with these wheels. Oh, wait a second. Hold on. Let's do reset and attempt to put on the brake. 
or whatever that's worth. I hate that those rotors aren't working. I, think I want them to. Um, all wheels. Is there like a torque or anything like that? Let's take friction up to 100%. Um, power supplied to propulsion. 100%. 100%, baby. Uh, let's turn off the dampener so our thrusters aren't constantly going. Okay, let's turn off parking brake. And... Um, Uh, no, a hundred, I want a hundred percent. Hey, that's maybe working better. Oh, man, it's sure trying. Yeah, see, it's not gripping as much as I would like anyways. The fact that that suspension in the back, right there, is bouncing. Tells me that having the suspension design on all four posts is just not working the way I want it to. Booster's on! Damn it, this is just not going to work. Man. It would have been so cool, though. I guess I'm going to have to make it like a regular rover with regular wheels. Do like the 5x5 five five wheels. Dang, I was so hopeful that it would be super cool. Okay, well. I guess I could technically do more boosters, but even the suspension is not acting like the way it should be with the amount of weight that's on this thing. Yeah, no grip. Okay. Well, shoot. Let's exit without saving. Yeah, it just needs the bigger wheels. And I guess I could... The problem is, I could try to do this like how the actual Curiosity Rover is. Um, sorry, I'm sitting back again. Nope, it's not working. I'm sitting back up. And I can't get comfy today. Um, I could do it like Curiosity where this whole three-wheel thing, there's only one on each side pivoting along the center. The problem is, is I've only seen one other person do it, and they had to create some... They had to do a lot of scripting to make it so that this center piece stayed level the whole time. Otherwise, it'll just rotate out of control and crash. Um, and I don't have the skills in this game yet to do that. So that might all have to be like a future project slash attempt. And I guess I'm just going to have to do like three big ass wheels on each side. The five by fives. Oh, because... Anything on a separate grid can't be controlled, and that includes wheels. Why are you rotating? Stop it. Uh, like, I can't even do, like, just this part right here with, like, a rotation in the middle in the back because I still can't control those wheels. And I don't want to make this seem, like, super complicated to drive. Since I don't know scripting that well yet, I really just can't do anything. I'm like going through my head trying to think of ways to like get around this problem like at all, and it's just not working. So that's a little sad. You can't do anything complicated um, suspension ideas because of this. Why is that a thing? I feel like that's something that they should have like. Because I saw those posts talking about it from 20, 2018. Why am I falling off this? 
This is weird. Why am I sliding off? Look at me. I can dance. I can do the moonwalk. Because I'm an astronaut. Get it? There's a programmable block that takes C sharp. Oh, hey, I know C sharp. Actually, I actually know C sharp pretty, pretty darn well at this point. Yeah, I just don't know the API for calling things. Oh, damn it. Like, for sure, we'll get into programmable blocks at some point. Absolutely for sure. But I want to get to the point where I have, like, a small fleet of, like, you know, regular working ships at least. And have something, like, on the planet and in space. And then we'll get into some more fun, complicated stuff. It was my hope, but I don't know. Well, then that begs... Uh, no, I need this rover. I can't just leave this here like this and build another one. This took me for freaking ever to build. <laughs> and I'm not going to go through and build again. And I'm not sure I want to take this apart right now on stream because that's like a lot of grinding and going back and forth and dumping things. Grinding, going back and dumping things. Grinding, going back and dumping things. That'd just be boring to watch. I'd rather like watch a movie while I was doing it, if I'm being honest. Oh, golf fell in. So I'm almost tempted to end stream there. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Can't, I, can't, I just can't get over how disappointed I am that this didn't work. Why is that a thing? Hmm. Well. Nothing else I'm for sure done in this game for right now. I don't know if you guys are in the mood to watch me play something else or are ready to go on and do other things tonight. It's not a perfect physics game. It should be perfect, Jibo. It should be perfect. Yeah, dang it. I wonder if this is just... Man, I feel like they should have addressed that already. I'm going to write them a, a strongly worded letter of how disappointed in their game I am. <laughs> it would have worked if you built it in real life. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like it would have worked pretty well, too. Maybe I should build a rover like... Th or build a uh, RC car like this. Some crazy suspension. That'd be kind of fun. Okay, well, let's... Let's save and exit to main menu. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to call stream here unless you guys have something you'd rather watch me play. I'd be willing to play another game for a little bit, like another half hour. Um, nah, I'm just going to call it. Thanks for hanging out. Um, yeah, I'll grind a little bit off stream and try to get those wheels fixed up to a better working state, I guess. Then yeah, I don't know. At some point, I guess I got to start thinking of ideas of other stuff I want to build too. So I'll have to be thinking of that. Um, and that, I'll hope I see you in the next one. Yeah, see ya.